Well, here we are again, reporting on racist abuse in football. It just happens con continually with no punishment. Anthony Alanga has been subject to vile racist abuse after uh, he missed the penalty that got saw United get knocked out of the FA Cup to Millsborough. And it looks like it was United's own fans that have done that. Um, and actually, it's not really a surprise, but Instagram took down some of the comments and are investigating. But again, I don't know what they'll actually do about it. Meta, who are now the company that own Instagram, formerly Facebook, revealed that they will investigate. And it was, uh, you know, just the usual garbage, like monkeys and stuff like that. Uh, Alanga almost scored when he came on and like... It's just pathetic. No, nothing seems to be done. And actually, uh, football is a huge, huge industry. And they don't really seem to be doing much about resolving this issue. People need to be banned. If you send something racist like that, you should be banned for life from the stadium. You should have your social media accounts monitored moving forward because you're not suitable to actually have a social media account, you know. And but like yeah, you know, Instagram are going to investigate it. And I think there was an interesting uh, tweet there by Troy Towns, and he said spokesman from Instagram has said they've already removed a number of comments, and he's investigating, and he's put blah blah blah, roll out the obligatory statement to appease who, and he's right. You know, the whole the, the whole of football is going through the motions in relation to racism. There really needs to be like strict, stringent punishment. If you're caught sending even racist messages on Twitter, Instagram, or whatever, you, they should come down in like a ton of bricks. I'm just, to be honest, I, I actually just not surprised and just a bit sick of it. And you know, the, there has to be some sort of way to weed this out. And it's not an isolated incident. United about it with Martial, Tu and Zabi. They were subject to uh, racist abuse. You saw Sancho, Rashford and Saka after the Euros, after they all missed penalties. And yeah, I'm sick of it. The players are obviously sick of it. And actually, nothing's being done. And we're going to have this same conversation in five years' time about, oh, we need to kick racism out. A lot of platitudes taking the knee, but nothing's actually done. Should be in deep trouble for doing things like that, in my view. But anyway, what do you think? Please comment below. Sad day though, and it's sad that it's still happening. People are people are stupid and ignorant in every way, and it's a real yeah, it's upsetting. But what can you do? Never mind.